Hi students, this is T. Balakrishna, Kimish Lecture, GPT, Kottakudam. Today our topic is Arhini's theory of acids and bases. Arhini has proposed the electrolytic theory of acids and bases in 1887. According to this theory, acid is defined as a chemical substance that contains hydrogen and ionizes in aqua solution to give hydrogen ion. The chemical substance which produce or gives H plus ions in aqua solution. The chemical substance which produce or gives H plus ions in aqua, aqua means water, aqua solution. Aqua solution, the substance which produce H plus ion in aqua solution, that substance is called acid. So, if you have to use H plus ions, then you can use compulsory hydrogen atom which contain hydrogen it ionizes into water and produces pression so it should have hydrogen and it is in a molecule so substance it contain more than two elements so so another element is x so when it is ionizes into water it produce h plus and x minus h x so the general formula of acid is h x the general formula of acid is h x so this is called acid the chemical substance which produce h plus ion is in aqua solution that chemical substance is called acid it should contain at least one hydrogen atom that atom is ionized into water it produce H plus ion so if you want to write the examples for acid you take X is equal to, you take X is equal to Cl what is the molecule example molecules are here H and X is a Cl so that molecule is HCl example for acid is HCl if you want to take X is equal to NO3 X is equal to NO3 that is HNO3 molecules HNO3 molecules if you take X is equal to CH3 COO minus. So that molecule is that is CH3 COOH. So these are all examples for acids. Is it clear? The general formula of the acid is HX. The chemical substance which produces H plus ions in aqua solution is called acid. So it should have H that H is ionized into water to produce H plus ions. So X is very vari variable. Okay. So if you are substitute X is equal to Cl, there is an HCl. If you are substitute substitute X is equal to NO3, that is HNO3. If you are substitute X is equal to CH3 CO minus CH3 COO. H that is in a acetic acid. These are the examples for acids. According to the Arrhenius theory, what is the definition? The, ke the chemical substance which produce H plus ions in aqua solution is called acid. According to the Arrhenius theory, base is defined as the chemical substance that ionizes in water produce hydroxyl ion 
the chemical substance which is ionizes in water ionizes in water that is called aqua solution it should produce oh minus ion that is hydroxide ion hydroxide ion should produce hydroxide ion that chemical substance is called base that means it should contain oh molecule contain oh molecule so if it is in a substance it should have positive charge ion and negative charge ion so i take another element or matrix consists as m okay mboh so mboh is ionizing to the water it produce em plus and oh minus m plus and o so this substance is ionizes into water it should produce oh minus ion so such type of substance is called base because it produce hydroxide ion in ionizes into and is in uh, aqua solution so in this case you take m is equal to m is equal to m is equal to, m is a variable x is the oh uh, is a constant you take m is equal to n a so they give the examples of acids examples or examples of base examples of base so m is equal to na what is the uh, uh, m is equal to na you substitute m is equal to na that is n a o h it is one of the example for base if you want to substitute m is equal to k that is k o h potassium hydroxide if you want to substitute m is equal to n h 4 plus ammonium so we get ammonium hydroxide NH4 OH ammonium hydroxide this is an ammonium ion okay so the chemical substance which produce hydroxide ion in aqua solution that chemical substance is called base it should have at least one hydroxyl molecule the chemical substance which produce H plus ions and gives H plus ions in aqua solution is called base it should contain at least one hydrogen at least one hydrogen that is the definition of acid definition of base according to the arrhenius theory the chemical substance which ionizes into the water and produce H plus ions is called acid the chemical substance which produce OH minus ions in aqua solution is called base the next definition is salt the substance which can neither give H plus ions or OH minus ions in aqua solution the chemical substance neither nor give H plus ions and OH minus ions. The chemical substance not gives H plus ions and OH. A chemical substance I take H plus ions in Istundo aqua solution low than acid and A chemical substance I take OH minus ions is in the aqua solution low than a base and A chemical substance I take H plus ions in OH minus ions don't read me even though and take H plus on the conic H plus on the good. M plus is Sundan Kuntan. Okay. Uh, OH minus N over the property X minus N is Sundan Kuntan. So it subs the chemical substance neither gives H plus ions nor OH minus ions. So what is the formula? MX. MX is the general formula of the salt. General formula of the salt the chemical substance neither nor give h plus ions and oh, neither gives h plus ions nor oh minus ions in aqua solution aqua means h2o aqua solution 
aqua solution is it clear so what is the examples for aqua solution we know the m is equal to na aka ammonia x is equal to cl minus so you add both the variables uh, for example m is equal to na x is equal to cl so examples for examples for salt m is equal to na x is equal to cl that is na cl n is equal to k x is equal to cl that is a k cl okay so n k is n is equal to k x is equal to no3 that is a k no3 and uh, you write many example uh, okay right? so it, when it is split into ants for example you take na cl it is split into ants it produce na plus n cl minus it neither gives h plus ions nor oh minus ions in aqua solution so that is called salt a substance is the water lo eshinappudu h plus ions nu mariyu oh minus ions ni ivvado dani salt untam edaina oka chemical substance nu water lo eshinappudu h plus ions isthe dani acid untam daniki examples edaina chemical substance nu water lo eshinappudu oh minus ions nu produce chesthe dani base untam example sodium hydroxide potassium hydroxide so when you are dissolve the sodium hydroxide in water it produce na plus and oh minus so it produce oh minus n so that is a base you take hcl when it is dissolved in water it produce h plus n and cl minus n so it produce h plus n so it is an acid when that is when you add in water it produce h plus n that is an acid when you add in water it produces oh minus and that is base the chemical substance which is dissolved in water it uh, ni neither gives h plus ions nor oh minus and that is a salt example nacl it gives na plus and cl minus so according to the arrhenius theory as it is defined as the chemical substance which produce h plus ions in aqua solution the chemical substance which produce OH minus ions in aqua solution is called base. The chemical substance neither nor give H plus ions and OH minus ions in aqua solution is called salt. Thank you, students. This is T. Balakrishna, Chemistry Lecture, GPT Kotagudan.